and in other um, pretty disgusting news, because I wanted to leave this as we kind of continued on with the podcast. This is courtesy of Newsweek. Chris Chan, the original local of the internet, somebody who I kind of seen from afar, you know, every time I've been on social media, right? He's kind of the butt of jokes and because he says and does really weird stuff and he may or may not have some sort of uh, mental illness or whatever it may be or mentally handicapped, whatever the correct term is. But whatever the fact, he is one of the original low cows and somebody you always see kind of pop up in your timeline, but you don't really think too much about. Well, everyone's speaking about him the other day and I saw it and I kind of had to Google or I had to kind of search his name on Twitter and then I found the clip and I was just like, oh my God, barfing in my mouth. It says, Chris Chan arrested for incest in Virginia and you're saying what yes very true internet personality Chris Chan has been arrested on a charge of incest the 39 year old artist blogger and YouTube star whose official name is Christian Watson Chandler is held at the Henrik County Regional Jail in West Virginia in a statement issued by Internews Nick Henrico, Cant- Henrico County Sheriff Alyssa Gregory said Christian Watson Chandler is currently being held in jail um, at one count of incest and awaiting an arrangement in Green County Virginia Sheriff Gregory was unable to provide any further comment relating to the arrest um, other than she said the criminal charges are not for Henrico County but for Green County and Gregory said we are just housing until transport can be arranged so it's not even something that's been committed in a state that he's actually in but it's such a heinous crime that they're just holding him until they can transport him to the relevant place China is best known for the Sun the Hedgehog and Pokemon comic crossover character Sun Chu, um, which has been a subject of numerous artworks since 2004. He, she also created the character of Rin Chu and Sun Chu's love interest in the same series. The 39 year old has nearly 60,000 followers on Twitter, posting under there. However, he says, I am Chris Chandler. Da, 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 da. Um, according to her Patreon account, she is known as Christian, Christopher, Chris Chan, and so forth among her fans. Chan's Facebook profile states that she attended Manchester High School. Da, da, da. Though the profile says she is married the social media star has never made any mention of the wedding partner in the post chan's latest post on facebook on july 11th where she said a picture of her mother barbara this is supposedly the mother it's just like when you see and you read the account and you listen to the audio clip you're like oh my god barbie chan got a stylish haircut i did first time cutting anyone's hair the caption reads it looks really good barbie who's sometimes referred to as barb or barbie for short has featured in several channels videos and social media posts over the years chan's last sweet post in july 30 featured an image of collective a community card game um, but the chance most of the, the, the yeah chance recent YouTube post titled direct message to Hasbro was posted the, the, the clip has been viewed four times so the alleged story is that somehow I don't know why he decided to unload and share the information that he was you know doing whatever with his mum um, who is suffering from dementia or something as well in her case and that conversation was recorded and that conversation was then leaked to the public and. I just don't know where to start, man. I really don't, man. These low cows and these internet personalities, there is something, there must be something in the fact that in order to be successful on the internet and to have some kind of following, whether it's for negative reasons or positive reasons, that you have to be somewhat mentally ill. You have to have a screw loose. You have to be somebody that engages in some you know reprehensible disgusting stuff like it just has to be there is no way that you could just be like a regular schmegular down the line kind of dude and oh well they, they do exist don't get me wrong but it seems like the majority of people are absolutely insane and they get up to all sorts of craziness behind closed doors um it just seems to be the way of the you know the way it is for people like that live on the internet like that like a christian um i read that story and i was just like god damn but again because of the way we are in the world it also didn't shock me as much as it did as much as it should maybe because i'm you know on flipping usacrime.com all the time looking at flipping cct footage of people getting shot you know in the streets of new york every single day or weird crazy you know um, watch someone die subreddit type things i don't know why but it didn't shock me as much as it really should have which then goes a lot to say about the desensitized nature that we're in living in at the moment where we just see so much, so much messed up stuff on a daily basis that when you hear of some low cow engaging in incest with their your, your old mother that might be suffering from dementia you're just like meh and you kind of keep it moving which you really shouldn't because it's pretty disgusting um beyond disgusting really it's just like i don't know i really don't know man it's just good to see that you know finally some you know actual police 
peak, you know, some actual law enforcement came in and was able to step in because sometimes nasty stuff or really corrupt weird stuff happens on the net and for some reason it just seems to get swept under the carpet and people don't seem to get charged it seems to be a bit strange with when it comes into their personalities but at least that got dealt with in some sort of sensible manner